What's up everybody, it's Neil here with Gadget Hacks, and today I'll be showing you how to apply an advanced power menu to your jailbroken iOS device. So for those of you who aren't jailbroken, if you notice when you hold your, your sleep button, it just gives you the power off option. Sometimes you just want to restart your phone, but you just have to manually power it down and hold it again and power it back up. There's no reboot or something like that. And if you're jailbroken, you'll often have to respring your device or or uh, enter safe mode if it's glitchy. Um, respringing is often needed when you when you apply a, a theme or something. We'll go into what each of these power menu options actually do. But in order to actually get the power menu, of course, you'll need to be jailbroken. And after you do that, just head into Cydia, and we're going to search and install the tweak called SB Power. Oops. SB Power alert there you go so it's right there I've already installed it and I already reboot my device or resprung it so after you do that you're gonna go into your actual settings and adjust the preferences of this tweak so let's go to our actual settings app and all the way at the bottom you'll see all your tweaks and we're gonna enter SB power alert settings so from here you can edit what's displayed on your power menu so you have some options up here that actually display some system information like data, data IP, Wi-Fi, uh, free RAM storage and stuff like that. You also have iOS version. I don't really want to display any of that, but maybe I'll just do it for the sake of this video. I'll just toggle those on. And then you can actually edit the buttons that show up like reboot, which powers on your device and powers it back up. Then you have power off, which just shuts your device down. Then you have respring, which actually just refreshes your springboard. And your springboard is essentially your home screen or your home pages. And then you have safe mode, which boots your device back up into safe mode, which disables any tweaks you may have applied. Tweaks and themes will be disabled. And then you can also do show lock if you want to lock it that way, though I don't find that necessary. So once you've made your your changes and you have your power menu set up the way you want it, we need to do an activation method. So this tweak actually comes packaged with another tweak called activator and you can actually access it through here. So we're going to choose an activation method and this lets us apply a gesture or basically lets us toggle on this tweak with a number of methods. You can um, do it by swiping, uh, double pressing this, triple pressing, you can do a lot of things but I'm going to go ahead and suggest that you use the sleep button so right here you see sleep button, do a, a short press or short hold on that just because it comes naturally because usually this is when you access your power down option. So everything's all set up so now I'm going to go ahead and show you how it looks. So I'm going to do a short hold on my sleep button and there you go. I have my options to reboot, power off, respring, or enter safe mode. And then up there you have the information that I showed you or I toggled on. So it's pretty useful, especially if you're using a bunch of jailbreak tweaks, and I think it comes in handy daily as I use it often to respring and stuff like that. But yeah, definitely check out the full guide on GadgetX.com. Also, don't forget to like, comment, and definitely subscribe for some more awesome Gadget Hack videos. Thanks, guys.